guys welcome back to my channel it's Midwest Mama we are starting off the new year with a tiny tidy Tuesday and working in my January monthly um, this is out of my if I could turn the page this is out of my new Erin Condren um, 2024 vertical planner so only things that I have done I added this Planner Girl sticker that I got from a shop and kind of put some goals that I'm looking into doing, like my healthier lifestyle, making better money choices, and I really need to work on the basement decluttering, and my husband really needs to work on the garage, <laughs> so, um, but yeah, so um, this kit is from Plan to Plan. Um, if you've been watching, you know that I do like to use a lot of her kits. So it's all pre-done, obviously, to save some time. Um, so let's just get started. So I'm actually doing this before the month starts, so it's kind of actually exciting. Um, so the first is just New Year's Day. I don't have any plans. This day is going to start me making better choices health-wise. So um, I don't know what that entails yet, but, you know, I just know that's the day. Um, Tuesday, I am having a coffee date with my good friend, Kelly. We need to go over the Girl Scout cookie season together. We are cookie co-chairs. And I think the next day, um, the website goes live and stuff. So we just need to talk and, um, get like a, a text thread going to let everyone know. Um, we have not chosen a time yet, but, um, and then Kayla has her first physical therapy appointment this evening. I do not have any stickers for that. Um, and my kids are still on break this week. The third is just my Trulicity because a holiday is on. I'm assuming this is a typical like holiday holiday where they skip a day for trash. So I'm hoping, um, you know, cause Christmas day, everyone, you know, I mean, they skipped it because of that day. So I'm hoping it's the same. Um, so, okay, I'll do put my Trulicity. And honestly, I'm kind of nervous that my medicine's not going to make it in time. It's telling me right now the 8th. So that's not good. So I'm hoping that they kind of rush this because that's kind of freaking me out. And of course, it's my fault because I ordered it last minute. Okay, so we are going to say that Trash Day is on the 4th. And then Kayla has another physical therapist appointment this day. So I don't know if I discussed, but it turns out. Um, so the the women in my family um, that I know of, it's just my mom, Caitlin, me, and Kayla. We all have knee issues. And um, my mom, you know, I don't ever know why she had issues. She never, you know, told me or I don't know if she ever went to the doctor. Um, same thing with me. I just, you know, never went. Just figured, oh, my mom has it. So I probably have it. And then I know we took my adult oldest to the doctor because her knees hurt her while she was playing soccer. And I think she might have messed up her knee or something like that. And I know at one point... I remember a doctor saying that she was in, like, there's four stages of the knee, the issues that we have. I don't know how to explain it. And um, I think she was in, like, one or two, and she needed some kind of shot. And then, like, nothing came of it. So, um, yeah. So, anyways. So, okay. Uh, troop meeting. Okay, so this is a robotics badge that we are, or not me, but the kids are earning... And it's at 4 p.m. So 
Kayla has been complaining about her knees for a lot longer than Caitlin ever has. I think she was like 14 when she did. Um, Kayla's been complaining since she was about four, three or four. And um, a lot of times they would just tell her um, it's, you know, it's growing pains. And I was so tired of hearing that because I just feel like no one took it seriously. And so finally her new pediatrician is like, Let's let's take her to physical therapy and see what they think. And it turns out that she does have weak hips and weak ankles. And the way that her ankles sit, they're they're not where they're supposed to be. So it's I don't know how to explain it, but she has to do like these like these foot exercises that make her stronger and like all these these she has like five that she needs to do daily. And um I see what the doctor is talking about, like where um, her ankles are and where they should be. So we have gotten like better shoes, um, actually basketball shoes. Um, and so that's where we're at. So, um, she just is going to go to physical therapy. I think we're we'll do six sessions and see how that goes. Um, let's okay. Friday payday pedicure appointment. Kayla is auditioning again. And this time it is for beauty and the beast. So crazy because she just got done with a Christmas story. Um, the sixth is our virtual cookie cookie kickoff day. Um, I don't even know what that is. So again, I need to kind of educate myself. I haven't even taken the cookie training um, for being a leader. So I'm kind of behind. Um, so anyways, yeah. So we're hoping that this physical therapy helps her. And the new shoes as well. Because, like, as soon as she put the new shoes on and she um, was wearing them, she was like, my ankles don't even hurt. So, apparently, it's giving her more support. And that's that's really all we needed. All right. Seventh, eighth. Ninth is... Okay. So, she has two conflicting things. And I'm going to have to reschedule this one. So, she does have physical therapy. She is back in school. Um I should put a school resume here. Um, however, she is now also in basketball. So I kind of want her to go to that. I want to just want to reschedule this one because they only have practice two times a week. And this child is just very, very busy. So, um, yeah. So basketball at... 4 30 and then this evening I am going to a meeting for it's a leader meeting for Girl Scouts and that is at our local church over here um I'm gonna be right back because I think I have some different dates for her practices okay so I'm actually a little confused but I did find um a back to school sticker that I thought was just adorable okay so I'm a little confused on the schedule here so um she does have practice this day and it's from 4 30 to 6 and then okay so we'll go with the 10th here so the 10th I have oh I have trash day okay we are back to normal trash day here okay we're gonna go with trash day and then I have a manicure appointment. And thank you. Thank goodness because I cracked this one. And I'm hoping my nails last that long. Because I think I'm going to need a new set soon. Okay. Um, how are we going to do this? I think I'm going to do it like right here. So manicure at 1 p.m. And then Trilicity. Okay, so she has basketball practice and therapy this day. Um, let's see. I'm just going to put people. She has people practice at 4. And then it ends at 5.30. However, her therapy is at 5.15. So I think... 
I am going to leave practice at five so we can make it to her physical therapy um, at 5.15. I'm not going to put her name because she's the only one that's having physical therapy and basketball. All right, the 12th. See, now they say the 12th is opening game night. And I don't have that. And then but there's a scrimmage the next week. So I'm so confused. So hmm. I think, all right, let's hold on. Okay, so the 13th is budget maker badge, which is a badge that she's earning um, about like money and stuff like that. It's about like, you know, the whole cookie season stuff. Budget maker badge. And I think this is at the church again, so I can just like drop her off. Um, 14th, I got nothing. 15th is Martin Luther King Day. The kids do not have school. Um, I found this cute, like, no school sticker. I don't know why I don't have anything here, but... Um, and then she has therapy again. And I really don't have anything. Okay, I just added this pink one in. Okay, 15th, she has therapy at 3.30. Okay, so the 16th is this scrimmage game, and I have it as a practice. So I think, I thought this was going to be like their first, like, practice game where like you know they split the two they split the the team or the girls into teams and then they have like a fake game against each other um it is blue and white night whatever that means um I guess they wear blue I have no clue okay so I'm just gonna put it's 4 30 to 6 and it's scrimmage game and treats whatever that means I think I need to read the text more. All right, the 17th. Okay, we're back to trash day. Trilicity day. Trash comes first. Oop, we're kind of overlapping. Whatever, that's okay. And I'm going to need some more Trilicity stickers. Very soon. Oh, I guess I could have put... Her other appointment in front of this. Um, she has a dermatologist appointment this day. She has some warts that we are going to start treating on the first. So, um, it's at two thirty. So I have to go immediately after school, and hopefully, um, we're done before Connor is done at his school. Okay, so. 18th we have a troop meeting and again this is working on robotics badge we missed the first meeting so I have absolutely no clue what these meetings are or you know what we're doing I'm assuming they will be earning it after this let's see robotics badge and that's at 4 p.m. Um, okay, so the 19th, Miss Kayla is, uh, it's also a payday, um, Kayla is doing winter camping with Girl Scouts. Um, they will be staying in, like, a cabin, um, they're hoping it snows because they want to use, like, snowshoes, and I guess they're going to learn how to sew with sewing machines, so we do have to drop her off, and she's going to be there Friday night. Saturday night, and then we're going to pick her up on Sunday. So I have nothing the 20th. Oh, you know what? I forgot on this day. My brother is coming. Let's put... Um, let's just put family time. I completely forgot. So my brother was in the hospital um, over Christmas, so we didn't get to celebrate. So I'm just going to put... Roland and Mimi and we didn't pick a time so I'm just gonna say probably like two because 
knowing him, he wants to get here early. All right, we got the 20th, nothing, flip over. Whoops. And then we do have to pick up Kayla at 10 in the morning. Okay, so 22nd, nothing. 23rd, Kayla has therapy again. And it is at 5.15. And again, this is going into basketball practice, I'm assuming. So I don't have any other schedules. So we're just going to go with what I have and we'll work around it. 24th is trash day. And we got a manicure that I forgot to put the time down, but I know is it a manicure? I feel like I had a pedicure somewhere. Oh wait, I already have I already have that down. Um, I feel like my manicure. Oh, I know why. Because I feel like it's around this time, but it's actually not set in stone. So I'm actually not even gonna put that down. Because who knows what my nail lady has um, in her books. Okay, nothing for the 25th or 26th. The 27th, I have a virtual baby shower that I'm attending, which I've never heard of before. Um, it is my niece's baby shower. Um, I have found a trash day sticker on my on my shirt with hair. Okay, I'm just going to pick it on my album here. Um, yeah, so she lives, I think she lives in Missouri. I don't even know where she lives, um, to be honest with you, because she's moved around quite a bit. But she is pregnant, and so um, because we're all over the place, um, we're basically, like, sending her gifts, and then she's going to open them online. I don't know. I've never heard of this before. Okay, so virtual, and it's a 2 p.m., but whatever. Um, and then... The 31st, again, is Trash Day and Trilicity. And that is the end of my month. I mean, and the thing is, like, as far as, like, the, um, the auditions and stuff like that, I mean, it'll probably take a week to find out if we know anything. And then, you know, you guessed it, rehearsals are going to start if she makes it. Um, this is open from eight to 18 year olds. So I imagine it's going to be a big production again, and it's probably going to be at the college theater. Um, yeah. So I know my plans will be more added. I always feel like when I do uh, monthly pre plans that it's just too early, but I have a pretty, um, solid month already. So anyways, I hope that you enjoyed this pre-plan with me of January. Um, I hope that you guys all had a great New Year's and please make sure that um, you check the description box below for the playlist. This is always an open collab hosted by Sunday Dawn from The Helpful Home and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!